from Story with Miss Haley. That's me. So this morning I read a story all about rainy weather and we learned a little bit about rain, where it comes from, what we need it for. So this afternoon I thought it'd be cool if we can make a rain experiment and learn a little bit more about rain and see it right in front of us. So what you're going to need to do this experiment is some water. You're also going to need a glass jar or any container that is see-through so that you can see it happening when we start seeing the rain. You're also going to need just a small bowl because we are going to put some water in here. You will need some blue food dye, a pipette. If you don't have a pipette that will suck up the water that you can squirt out, you can just use a small spoon. And lastly, some foamy shaving cream. Make sure it's the foam, not the gel, because the gel won't work. So some foamy shaving cream. And that's all that you're going to need. So the first thing you need to do is fill your glass. And I put down a towel just to make sure that if anything spills over, I don't get anything on my counter. So I'd recommend getting a towel, paper towel, newspaper, something to put underneath your jar. Now we're going to fill this just about three fourths full because we need to save room to put our shaving cream on the top. So let's go ahead and add in our water. There we go. So now I have some space at the top for my shaving cream. So now once you've added the water, let's go ahead and make our blue water mixture. So now you're going to take your bowl and put some water in there. Now we're gonna add some blue food dye to it to change the color to blue so that we can see the rain when it goes down into our other water. So let's add some blue food dye. Use your spoon or a little pipette to stir it. There we go, so now we have blue water. So now everything is ready to go. We have all of our mixtures put where they need to be. So now the next thing we're going to do is add our foaming shaving cream on top of the water. And you want it to look like the cloud. So right now what we're making is the cloud that you see up in the sky. So go ahead and put some of that into your glass. There we go. So now I have my cloud up in the sky. I'm gonna start adding rain to our cloud to make it a rain cloud. Because right now it's just a nice white puffy cloud, which we learned doesn't bring rain. So now let's make it darker with our blue and we'll start seeing rain come down our glass. So let's add a little bit of our blue water and just put drops on top of your shaving cream. Now remember, it's gonna take a little bit of time because the rain needs to get heavy in our cloud before it'll start to fall. So let's see if that was enough rain. Oh, I'm not seeing any rain come down yet. So let's make our cloud a little more heavier with some more raindrops. Just put it all over the shaving cream, which is our cloud. All right, let's see if it's heavy enough now. Nope, not yet. So we're going to keep doing this until we get a heavy rain cloud and it starts to come down and out of our cloud because it starts to rain. Oop, I think it's starting to get there. I saw a little bit come out. And what you're going to start to see is some blue streaks down in the water, which is the rain coming out of the rain cloud. It's getting there. The water is starting to turn blue at the very top. I'm seeing some rain. Are you guys seeing some rain coming down out of our rain cloud? 
look at all of this blue that's coming down. This is all of our rain that came out of our cloud at the very top and is now coming down. Isn't that pretty cool? So that's what happens. We start with a white fluffy cloud. It doesn't have any rain. It starts to add some raindrops in there, which is our blue water. And as it got super heavy, it starts to come down out of the rain cloud and rain, which is what you can see in here with all of the blue that's coming out. Let's add a little bit more to see if we can get some more. Oh, that was a big raindrop that came out then. How cool! Now all the rain is coming down. You can see it at the top of the glass. You can start seeing some streaks coming down too. And that's all of our rain. So you can keep doing this experiment as much as you want. You can empty this out, put some more water in, put some more shaving cream in. If you wanted, you can make it look a little more rainbow. So you can choose different colors besides just blue water. You can make orange or pink water too and put those droplets all around and see if you can see all of the different colors that'll come out of the glass. So I hope you enjoyed this really fun rain experiment we did today. Come on back tomorrow for some more fun and activities and have a great rest of your day. Bye.